Hey guys, and welcome to a run through of a rocket I had just built the other night under direction of a friend. I think it's pretty cool. Uh, judging by, I did it at like three in the morning with. Uh, I was very tired. <laughs> Um, so I did this rocket and I'm very happy with it. Like, I especially like the tail fins, how they just kind of give it that look of circleness, I guess. Um, from here you can see the, the, um, the holding arm that holds the rock, that would hold the rocket in place. So it didn't tip over if there were high winds or anything. And, uh, if it shows it again, uh, right there in the corner, you can see there's redstone on the bottom to represent the, um, like, where the thruster is and stuff. I think the redstone blocks are really cool for making it look like that. Uh, this elevator is just representing the really slow climb it takes, or at least it looks like it takes for people to get up to the rocket entering area while it's on the launch pad. So yeah, just slowly going up. Then we get onto the walkway that brings you to the uh, door. Uh, nothing special, just pressure plates in the door. So you use buttons to get back out of the door. You look up, and then there's uh, there's the uh, airlock. <laughs> airlock use, using um, using trap doors. Had a little trouble there with the trap doors opening and closing. So the windows are at feet height, which gives it a look of, like, I don't know, like, it, I just like the look of it, where it's like you'd look out and you'd see the ground instead of the sky, because when you came up to here, all you'd see is the sky looking out of the windows, and then when you looked up, you would see well, nothing straight in front of you, but you would see everything at an angle. And then the journey back down. I was having problems finding where the uh, where the ladder was. Close the hatch again. Downstairs. The button out the door. There's your final look at the rockets outside. I might touch it up a little bit more, but for now, this is the finished product. Oh, yeah, then I added blinking lights in the uh, platform using a redstone timer and just other redstone to connect the lights together. So, yeah, this was fun. Um, I'm definitely going to be doing more builds like this, so I'll uh, see you guys later.